Hello kids. Let's solve some puzzle today. This puzzle has both multiplication and division. So let's start. Across is given. First one A. 7 times 30. 7 multiplied by 30. Simple multiplication. What is 7 times 3? 21. How many zeros are there? 1. Just multiply numbers first. Then how many zeros? 7 times 30 is 210. So this is across. Across. B. 208 divided by 4. Oh. In the last video, we learned division. So, let's do division. 208 is divided by 4. is divided by 4. Now, you need 4 times table. If you take only one number, this 2 2 is less than 4. So you can divide 2 by 4. So you have to take the other number also. The next number also. 20. Now 20 is greater than 4. Then you can divide. Now 4 times 1 is 4. 4 times 2 8. 4 times 3 12. 4 times 4 16. 4 times 5. What is 4 times 5? 20. Next, what you have to do? So, what is the next step? It's a subtraction. Now, we have to subtract. 2 minus 2, 0. What is the next step? Now, you have to bring down the next number. 0. So, there is nothing. So, you have to bring down next number. It's the next number? 8. Now, 8. 4 times 2 is 8. So, remainder is 0. And our quotient, this is the, our answer, it is quotient. 52 is our answer. So, let's write 52. 52. Now, A is done. B is done. Now C. What is C? C is given 270 divided by 9. Now, the first number 2 is smaller than 9. So, you have to take the next number also. That is 27. You have to take 27. 9 times 1, 9. 9 times 2, 18. 9 times 3 is 27. First you divide, then you multiply and write. That is 9 times 3 is 27. What is the next step? Subtraction. 7 minus 7, 0. 2 minus 2, 0. And what next step is? You have to bring down. Yes, 0. Bring down. So what you have to do now? Now you have to write 0 here. After bringing down, if it is a 0, then you have to write 0 in the quotient also. This 0 is called placeholder. You cannot leave as it is. You brought down this 0, so you have to write 0 in the quotient, that is, which is called placeholder. So, our answer is 30. That is 30 times 9 is 270. 270. So, for C, 30. Now, D. What is D? 30 times 69. 
multiply first you have to multiply with 9 you can write like this also for your convenience 30 times 69 multiplication first you have to multiply unit place of first number to first number that is 9 times 0 is 0 then then once place of second number to tens place of first number 9 times 3 is 27 now what is the placeholder you have to for tens place you are multiplying taking tens place so you have to put placeholder 0 6 times now you have to multiply with this unit place of first number to 10th place of second number 6 times 0 is 0 now 6 times 3 6 times 3 is 18 here you have to add 0 7 plus 0 7 2 plus 8 10 1 plus 1 2070 for D our answer is 2070 2070 D is done now next E 40 divided by 10 this is very easy 10 times 4 is 40 so the answer is 4. E is 4. Now F. 10 times 75. 10 multiplied by 75. 75 times 7, 1 is 75. 0. 750. Now, F is done, down, across is done, now it's down. What is A? 225 divided by 9. So, we have got the answer, but let's verify. We have got 25, let's verify. 225 divided by 9 so let's check if our answer is correct or not here 2 is smaller than 9 so you have to take the next number also that is 22 9 times 1 9 9 times 2 18 9 times 3 27 9 times 2 is 18 and 9 times 3 is 27 so which one you have to take 9 times 2 9 times 3 is 27 27 is greater than this 22 so you have to take 9 times 2 which is 18 you have to divide with 2 9 times 2 is 18 so next is subtraction here 12 minus 8 is 4 1 minus 1 0 this 4 is smaller than 9 so you have to take you have to bring down the next number that is 45 9 times 5 is 45 remainder 0 so answer that is quotient is 25 so this is 25 so your answer is correct now c 5 times 75 what is 5 times 75 for dumb c 375 we have got the answer 375 we can check if 5 times 75 is 375 or not
फाइव टाइम्स सेवेंटी फाइव और सेवेंटी फाइव टाइम्स फाइव दे आर इक्वल सो कमिटेड फाइव टाइम्स फाइव ट्वेंटी फाइव टे टू थेरी टू फाइव टाइम्स सेवेन थर्टी फाइव फाइव टाइम्स सेवेन इज थर्टी फाइव थर्टी फाइव प्लस टू थर्टी सेवेन थ्री हंड्रेड सेवेंटी फाइव सो योर आंसर इज करेक्ट ई थ्री हंड्रेड ट्वेंटी टू डिवाइड बाय सेवेन थ्री हंड्रेड ट्वेंटी टू डिवाइडेड बाय सेवेन here we have to take 32 because 3 is smaller than 7 so you have to take two numbers that is 32 7 times 4 is 28 we have to take 7 times 4 plus 5 is 35 which is greater than 32 so you cannot subtract so you have to take 4 7 times 4 is 28 subtract 12 minus 8 4 bring down the next number 7 7 times 5 35 7 times 6 42 so answer is 46 e one number is we have got one number 4 the other number is 6 Now, nine times four. Sorry, nineteen times four. It's easy. What is nineteen times four? Nineteen times table, so which is seventy-six. Now let's check the last one. G, which is three hundred sixty-six divided by three. Here we have got the answer one hundred twenty-two. Let's verify our answer. G is three hundred sixty-six divided by three. Three times one, three. Subtract. Bring down, bring down the next number. Three times two is six. Subtract. Bring down the next number. Three times two, six. Subtract. Remainder zero. Our answer is one hundred twenty-two. Here we have got the answer one hundred twenty-two. So we have solved our puzzle. See you in the next video. Bye bye.